Well, some of the first things you'll notice with this drum set is it's a little bit smaller than a conventional drum set. Uh, the, uh, the drum throne is quite a bit smaller, so it looks like it'd be comfortable for a six, seven, eight year old kid, uh, all the way up to maybe early teenage. The, the whole kit is uh, proportionately smaller than a typical drum kit. The snare drum is a pretty good size, actually, and uh, I'm actually really impressed with the sound of the snare drum. Uh, overall, I'm actually impressed with the, the sound of the whole drum set. I had it mic'd up at a concert. You couldn't even tell it was a small drum set. It sounded big as soon as we put the microphones on it. Of course, I was not using the cymbals that came with it. The snare drum never turns completely off. That was another thing I liked about the drum kit is the, uh, the floor tom. If uh, tuned just right, it has a very unique sound. The kick drum uh, in person doesn't sound that powerful, but you know, like I said, once again, when it's mic'd up, I don't know what happened. It just turned into a big sounding drum set all of a sudden. Right now I have a buffer pad in the kick drum. I will pull that out right now. I pulled out the buffer pad on the kick drum. And let's hear the hi-hat. It kind of reminds me of Animal from the Muppets. Tell you what, if you're going to get this for your kid, it actually it would be a really great set. Um, if you also want to get this kit uh, for playing live and just being extremely small and lightweight, it actually worked out really good. comes with it. Uh, feels a little bit cheap, but it works pretty well. Now the hi-hat that came with this, the hi-hat stand, is actually more durable than the one that I use on my drum kit. 